What's up YouTube, Brick Rider Garage coming at you for a non-Lego haul on my Lego page. Now, what I have in this package is pretty exciting. This is something that was on Kickstarter about a year ago. And you're probably thinking, why are you sharing a non-Lego thing on your Lego page? And I am normally pretty strict about this of only sharing Lego things on my Lego page. But, I know there's a lot of you out there that have ADD like me. Like I said a minute ago, I found this on Kickstarter about a year ago when I was at work working nights. And I was bored out of my mind. Now, I stay pretty busy at work. I run a 10 color printing press that makes plastic bags. So there's always something to do. But every now and then you get a little bit of downtime and I've had some downtime in the break room. And I found this. I was like, wow, this is an amazing product that would help me stay focused when I need to focus. But I didn't have any money to support on Kickstarter. It's one of those things, we all see those things on Kickstarter where like, Man, I really, really, really hope somebody, they get enough funding to make this, because this would be amazing. They made it. And I got two of these. Kind of on accident, but I have one for home now and one for work. This is called a stress cube. Now, when it was on Kickstarter, it was called a fidget cube. Find your focus. What this thing is... It has everything. If you ever play with pens or stuff at work, this is for you. Or just have to be constantly doing something with your hands. This little guy is for you. Now, this is the first time I've actually ever touched this. It's got a little toggle thing. It's got buttons you can click. It's got things you can tether. It's got an on-off switch. It is just, it's just amazing. Because you keep it in the palm of your hand and stay focused what you're doing. Now, when I, I am a press operator now. So I have to, once my press is up and running... I have to watch three monitors making sure that what I'm printing is what is required and there's no defects in the print and making sure my inks don't run out. And I have a console and I have a little pie tape measure, you guys know what they are, they're little things that it just, it's round. So I'll put it on, put it on top of my console, go bloop, as I'm watching the screen, let it roll down, keep doing it, or I'll take my other tape measure and start throwing it around. This is what, I'm so excited through it. This is what I'm taking to work tomorrow. Like I said, I accidentally bought two. I really wanted to. And my wife saw me order and we had some issues on our end, not on stress cubes end. Now I have one for home. So I'm at home. I can play with it and listen in better. And now I have one of these for work and keep my toolbox. I am super excited to take this to work tomorrow. Because these, these are just five buttons. This is the Black Widow edition I got there. Three or four different colors. You can look them up. Thestresscube.com. They have several different colors. There's compress, twist, switch, flow, swivel, and soothe. I said, I am super excited about this. I know this isn't a Lego, but I figured you guys wouldn't mind because, sure, I'm not the only one with ADD out there that needs something that's always playing with pens or whatever. This is so much fun. And I work in a factory, so they're not going to be able to hear a click. I'm going to feel a click, and that's what matters. So I'm going to be able to go like this and just really just focus. And I am super excited about this. So I hope you enjoyed this non-Lego haul, but something kind of helpful if you have ADD like me. You just need something to help you stay focused while you're doing stuff. Thanks for watching. Until next time, I'm Brick Rod Garage. See you later, guys.